Bismillah. For today's video, I'm gonna demonstrate or I'm gonna share with you on how to set up, configure, and install this screen studio for uh, this screen displays. But before we proceed, please don't forget to subscribe on my channel. In order to have a successful uh, lead screen setup, we need to prepare a set of computer to drive the lead screen displays as follows. One CPU, one monitor, one VGA cable, one DVI cable, VII, one VGA or graphics card with VGA and DVI port, one sending card for the display. Now connect video card and sending card to your computer and its cable. Then install the super driver of the video or graphics card like NVIDIA, ETI, and etc. And also software driver of a sending card. When device driver is successfully installed, configure the computer display. Configuration of computer display is the most important things to consider in order to ensure that the graphic card was able to send digital uh, signal to sending card. The sending card was able to send signal to lead screen displays. Therefore, to do it, configure display into multifold or uh, Duplicate display. Right click on desktop and click screen resolution. Then uh, select duplicate these displays. Then click keep changes and apply and OK. Let's check the NVIDIA settings. Just right click NVIDIA icon on system 3 and click NVIDIA control panel. So as we can see here, setup is on multiple displays. To check if configuration is successful, look at your sending card. So make sure that uh, the green lights of uh, sending card is blinking to ensure that the graphic card was able to send signal to it. Now let's proceed to the Lead Studio software installation and configuration. Let's open the software. You can download this free software at www.leadsnled.com. Now assuming you are already downloaded the installer, just click the exe file, click next, click next, then click yes. Then uh, just click next and just click next. Create a desktop icon, so just click next. Just click install. If you not yet installed your uh, sender or sending card driver, so let's configure the Lead Studio. Open the Lead Studio. Just click cancel. Put all your files in one folder and much better if you put your files in the desktop. Click file menu, then click new or select new. Click this menu, new page of program. Then click add stiff. Right click the step one, 
then click file window and do the same three times for the three groups of displays in my case is three three file displays so i'm going to add three file window here after that select file one then click this menu to add files then browse to your file folder then if you have more than one file so just press ctrl a on your keyboard then open so as we can see all file is added then do the same procedure to add files Now let's configure the size of this screen display. This black portion is representing the physical size of the LED screen. So we have to adjust this one first. That's why it is advantage to know the actual physical size, the width and the height of uh, our LED screen. Then uh, click option menu. Then uh, click uh, software setup. Then select floating. Make sure that enable changes by mouse is checked. Now I'm going to adjust the width and height based on its actual uh, physical size. So as we can see here, the black portion has been automatically adjusted. Alhamdulillah. So now, let's adjust the position of file or slide display. But before we forget, we have to save first list the files. Just click a file menu, save as, then type your file name. Note, it will automatically save to program data, folder and the studio, program files times 86 lead soft and program data now let's adjust the three files display either by mouse or by its figure first file displays let's adjust the width height star y and star x Now, let's adjust, uh, let's adjust the second file display. Now let's adjust the third file display.
then click save file to save changes and then alhamdulillah now let's check please to check the final result of our job then finally you have to configure auto start display when PC is turned on just click uh, option menu so for setup then click auto then check start when windows start up load file when starting and free documents when start up automat automatically then alhamdulillah so that is guy so thank you for watching hope that this video helped you and please don't forget to subscribe to my channel